Thank you, Jesus. So I want to take this time to uh, thank the Lord for uh, answering our prayers. I'm here at Hen at the Inner Community Hospital, Covina, mm -hmm. um, with, at, with Henry's room at his window. But I, I just want to thank the Lord for answering our prayers. And I want to thank everyone that is praying. Um, praise the Lord for um, the report we just got a little while ago that they the running test on his brain and they found brain activity. So at this time, you know, stop. Uh, if you could take some time to continue praying, uh, stop what you're doing and just be in agreement with us to pray. To continue praying that Henry will wake up and um, just continue asking the Lord to resurrect him off this bed. Um, we just want to thank God for, you know, all the endurance, all the strength, everything that, that God has been doing so far. Um, but, you know, God, God is faithful. And um, continue lifting up Henry Doremi, Mark Hernandez, Debbie Titus. Continue mm -hmm. praying. Continue praying for them. Continue praying for those that are sick, those that are afflicted, those that are going through it. Pray for the families. We believe in the power of prayer. And we stand by faith and declaring for our loved ones that they're going to rise from, the de uh, from their bed. They're going to leave this hospital. They're going to walk out of this hospital. We're believing in Jesus' name by the stripes of Jesus Christ that they are healed. We rebuke and we bind COVID-19 and any other form of infirmities. We ask that every single organ, that it will come to, uh, to life. And we're believing by faith. So God is on the move. He is in the business of doing miracles. He is in the business of making a way where there's no way. So in this time, pray. Pray. Seek Him. Lift up the name of Jesus. But I'm here at Inner Community, at Henry's window, and I just want to give God all the glory and all the honor. And He is worthy of all praise. And apart from Him, we could not do nothing. But we trust the Lord. The Lord has the last say so. His word does not come back void. His ways are higher than our ways, His thoughts are higher than our thoughts. And I rebuke and I bind every demonic spirit, every devil. You have no authority. And we, we take dominion and we use that power, that authority that God has given us, that anointing that's upon us. And as we pray for our loved ones and we believe and we declare over them, over our families, and we're asking for, for, for the body of Christ to come in, in, in oneness, one mind, one accord, and continue praying for Henry, for Mark, for Debbie, and anyone that else is that is down and afflicted. We're believing no weapon formed against them will prosper, not even a tongue that will rise. No matter what the report is, we're believing in God's report, and we're believing it by faith, and we're fixing our eyes on the author of life, and that's our Lord Jesus Christ. So today... Be blessed, know that God's in control, that all things are possible with God, and we serve the God of possibilities, we serve a miracle working God, and, and, and let's arise, let's arise with our prayers, let's arise with our faith, and continue marching on, continue moving forward. These are the, these are the days that the remnant church, the army, is gonna rise up and I'm believing and I'm declaring not only for those that are sick but I'm believing that all all believers I'm believing for all backsliders I'm believing that they're all gonna come back to the Lord for we are in the end days and I'm praying for every single person that has walked away from God to come back to the Father to come back to the Father. 
So right now, I just want to pray for Henry and for, uh, for the needs. So Father God, in Jesus' name, we declare, Father God, healing God to take place, Father God, for Henry, Father. We're believing God, Lord, that you're going to wake him up 100%, Father. We're believing that his lungs are, are going to work and function 100%. We're believing for every single organ on his body. We plead the blood of Jesus over Henry and everyone that is here in this critical unit that they're going to be healed and they're going to walk out of this place and there's and there's going to be great testimonies of, of God's working power and we're going to believe for Mark that's in Las Vegas battling COVID we're going to believe for Debbie Titus that's battling cancer that we cancel cancer we ba we cancel COVID in Jesus name because the name of Jesus is above cancer, above COVID, and above any other form of infirmity. And we believe by the stripes of Jesus Christ that they are healed. No more pain and no more sorrow. So agree with me. Agree with all those, all those that are praying. Know that God loves you guys. Be blessed. Thank you for your time.